Well, from Earth Day to outer space, today a middle school in Fort Mill is communicating with folks out of this world. Yeah, we're not talking about the aliens, right? They did make direct contact with the International Space Station. Larry Sprinkle was the only alien down there. Just kidding. <laughs> he was there yeah. for this historical you event. Know Larry, yes. Students at Fort Mill's Pleasant Knoll Middle School yeah. celebrated yeah. Earth Day all the way to the International Space Station. With help from the York County Amateur Radio Society, a group of local ham radio operators, the school was selected to become a direct contact school. I think as an educator, the one thing you want to do is provide like opportunities for kids that they're not going to get anywhere else. We helped her put an application in, went in, waited about three months. We heard we were on the short list. We did a technical review of our ability to make the station contact work and then we were chosen. The entire student body assembled into the gymnasium to witness this historical event. Are you interested in uh, space travel? I mean, I would do it if I got the opportunity. At exactly 1210, contact was made by science teacher Allison Kilowitz with International Space Station astronaut Matthew Dominic. NA1SS, NA1SS. Here is K4YTZ. On his ham radio in the ISS, Dominic answered questions from members of the school's ham radio club. And what is the consistency of your food and how does it taste? As the signal was beamed from a tower outside the gym to the ISS, everyone got an education into life 250 miles above Earth at 17,400 miles per hour. I'd say no days are typical. There's always something new up here. Uh, today we're packing the cargo jacket to send a bunch of stuff home to Earth uh, here in a few days. Uh, many days I'm doing, I'm a lab technician doing experiments or I'm talking to people on the ground. There's no typical day up here. It's all fascinating. Silver. It's a day these students, teachers, and staff will never forget. Thank you, Mr. Dominic, for your time today. I know these students are grateful for this opportunity. Over. Well, one of the answers was like about the sunrise and sunset and just how he thinks it's really cool to see. And I feel like it would be really cool to see it from there. It loves the everyday, what every day on the ISS looks like for you because it shows how the perception of time and perception of life truly has changed when you go up there. At Pleasant Knoll Middle School in Fort Mill, South Carolina, Larry Sprinkle, WCNC Charlotte.